Y'all, I just saw and heard the most heartbreaking thing. Basically, I was writing a message, minding my own business, but this young girl right next to me on the swing while I was at the park, she was telling someone on the phone that she was at the park with her sister because her sister wanted to go to the park with her girlfriend. And her ex girlfriend is also at the park so she was like how awkward is this now I'm at a park that I went to a fish place and this place is the hood okay the hood where back in the day that kind of stuff wasn't even tolerated dealt with parents didn't play no games and wasn't allowing their child to operate in something like that so I'm thinking to myself, surely this propaganda hasn't reached the hood. Like, when I keep saying the hood because I'm just saying like real black people. Real us black people that know what's up, that, that don't play by them same rules that they try to teach us in these white neighborhoods. Well, I told the girl, I said, it, I said excuse me, I, I apologize. <laughs> But I thought I heard you say something about your sister. And she said, yes. So I said, so is she? She said, yes. I said, like, she's gay. She says, yes. How old is your sister? Guess how old she says she, her sister is. 12 years old. 12 years old. Now, I see these 12-year-old girls come walking up looking like they about... 18, 19, 20, like some hard, some of them look like some butches, the other ones look like some, some real pretty girls smoking, using all kind of profanity. I had to nicely, because nowadays people be having weapons and stuff, guns, <laughs> them to not use profanity around the children. And I decided to go ahead and leave. Even though they were very respectful, children are desperate for discipline. But anyway, she said, well, yeah, that's what my mom says. Well, how could she possibly be gay? How does she know that? And I'm going to tell you where she comes up with this stuff from. It's, it's from movies. It's from television. It's from our music. It's from social media. Having all these people, those pretty girls who never even dealt, had the time to deal with a boy yet, talking about their gay. Parents, we need to do better. If our, our child come up to us with that nonsense, we need to straighten them out. They don't know what they're doing. We're the parent. That's part of the reason why we're there. We're supposed to create a strong foundation in our children, not let them just run free a foundation so that when they do stray, they will come back. Not from letting them like, oh, well, they know what's best for them. No, they don't. Or they wouldn't have need no. for you.